um, my nutrition and PKD journey started fairly early. Um, in fact, kind of funny, when I was in college, actually kidney nutrition was the last thing I was going to do because <laughs> it was the hardest. Um, and then I was actually diagnosed with um, PKD my last year of college. Um, and so at that point, um, the knowledge became empowering and I, I needed to do everything that I possibly could. And so I switched gears entirely and have spent um, all of my career actually in kidney nutrition and more specifically PKD nutrition. So the interest is personal um, and professional, I guess. Right. I think, um, you know, there's multiple steps in that. And more importantly, I think most importantly is um, individuality, that uh, there are so many different needs and goals that every patient has, and everyone's in a different spot in their PKD journey. So we start there. Um, what are your goals? Um, what are you hoping to achieve through nutrition? And how do we get you there? Um, what's the current function like we talked about because different function requires different nutrition needs um evaluating their current nutrition routine and basically seeing how we can boost their nutrition intake sometimes it's more important about what we add to a pkd patient's diet to give them the most optimal nutrition instead of taking away or restricting like everybody believes, everyone sees a renal diet or, or looks up a renal diet on the, on the web and they think, oh my gosh, what can I eat? But a lot of times it's about what can we add to boost nutrition intake? Um, and I think that's a major oversight. And then um, what's important to them? You know, what are the must haves in their daily routine? Um, what are the things they absolutely don't want to give up? Because a PK di D diet in the long term is only going to work if it's sustainable for the long haul. Oh, geez, the development of Keto Citra was like a gem for the PKD world because so many of us want um, a quick fix, but supplements, right? We don't know if they can hurt or help or you know, do, do major damage to our kidneys, but Keto Citra being the first medical grade food to actually be developed with PKD patients in mind and their specific nutrition needs, it's beautiful. And I think especially when combined with a carefully balanced diet, um, you've really created a nutrition powerhouse um, to sustain exactly what the PKD patient needs are. Well, actually, almost all of them, um, and in the few that don't, it, you know, it comes down to a financial thing, or it comes down to um, the flavor choices, which is super exciting. We're getting new flavor, <laughs> um, uh, but most of them do, yes, and ha and have great results and and use it very consistently. I think I mentioned it earlier, you know, knowledge is power. And the earlier that you can start doing some of these nutrition things that we are now coming to find out can be so important and pivotal, pivotal in the direction of our disease management, the earlier that you can start doing this, the more benefit that you're gonna have. Um, chances are you're gonna have the longevity of your kidneys, um, overall quality of life, better nutrition, um, et cetera, et cetera.